So you started the ketogenic lifestyle to look better, to feel better, and now all of a sudden you have all of this dry, flaky skin all over your body and you're wondering what the heck is going on and no matter how much lotion you, you pile on, it won't go away. So I'm here to tell you guys that is 100% normal and there's a reason for that. reason that you have dry skin when you get started on this lifestyle is that your body is shedding the water weight, which is great for you because you're going to feel less bloated, better. You're going to start seeing the number on the scale drop, but for your skin, it's not so great because this can shrink your skin cells, leaving you dry, itchy, irritated, all of the things that aren't really so fun. And this is one of those side effects that not a lot of people talk about. So. I have some suggestions for you. Um, one, while you are following the keto lifestyle, try to incorporate a lot of avocado in there because that is one healthy fat that does benefit your skin and the moisture quality of your skin. Now I wanna keep like kind of reassure you that this is only a temporary issue that will go away. Once your fat adapted, your body's used to this lifestyle, all of a sudden the normal moisture balance will, will return in your skin and it won't be this way. You won't have the dry skin or any of that. Now I actually really like using a um, like an oil in the shower and after shower oil to put oil on your skin while your skin is still wet. I have one that I like. I'll put it in the description of this video so you can check that out over on Amazon. As far as topical products are concerned, that seems to work the best in my opinion. If you found something that helps you with dry skin while you're following the ketogenic lifestyle, I would love to hear what you're using in the comments below, but that's just one big thing. The next thing is you might wanna stay out of the sun, out of the heat, while your body is kind of making this transition, if you notice you have a lot of dry skin, because the sun could actually irritate that more, make you more dry, especially if you're around salt water and stuff like that. So that's just one thing to consider if you do have this dry skin. So the next thing, you might wanna get a really good exfoliator and exfoliate that dry skin. Get it off you because then new skin turnover can happen. And you might also wanna integrate intermittent fasting in there because with intermittent fasting and extended fasting, you will actually be able to regenerate new skin cells and the newer, fresher, younger cells that come up are going to be even better than the ones that you had before keto that got dried up and sloshed off you. <laughs> Once again, if you find yourself with dry, itchy skin after starting the ketogenic lifestyle, it's only temporary, it will go away. Drink lots and lots of water, make sure you are Definitely getting the electrolytes that your body needs to maintain the moisture balance within there. And don't worry too much because like I said, it will go back to normal, your skin will be fine and you will not be plagued with dry, flaky skin the rest of the time you're doing the ketogenic diet. So use a moisturizer, a really great moisturizer like an oil, moisture right out of the shower. Um, consider maybe not taking a super, super hot shower because sometimes the really hot showers can, can strip the moisture out of your skin even more so than like a warmer to a cooler shower. This tip could actually is actually helpful maybe during the summer months, but in the middle of winter, the last thing you wanna do is take a cold shower, right? And I just wanna reassure you that what you're doing is really great for your health and you're gonna feel amazing. And this is just one of the signs that what you're doing is working and as your cells turn over and you start producing those newer, more supple, younger cells, you utilize intermittent fasting, you get that autophagy going and you start feeling better about yourself, your skin will catch up to you and you will start feeling better, looking better, and getting the energy you need to really 
keep pushing forward towards your goals. So if this video helped you, hit that little like button. And if you're new to this channel, be sure you hit that subscribe button. I share tons of tips and tricks to help you along the way with your ketogenic lifestyle. It is my mission and purpose to help you get the best results with this type of healthy living life. And um, I actually have a playlist for beginners that you can check out next if you're brand new here. And I will put that coming up next here on this little card over here. And thanks guys for watching this one. Take care.